An eight on your side investigation. Squatter secrets squashed. Imagine your house held hostage by squatters who have no right to be there. Tonight, 8 on your side uncovers a Bay Area business whose goal is to keep your property safe. Now, this is a unique business model, a home watch service designed to prevent squatters from taking over your house. 8 on your side, Shannon Bankett has details. The key here is appearance. If you have an empty home, it can't look that way. That's because that is an invitation to squatters. What I'm looking for and what they're looking for are almost identical. Scott Johnson is doing what would be squatters do all the time. That's definitely a potential. That's one that someone could be watching. He's on the prowl for empty houses, ones where no one would notice or care if strangers moved in. Is there, some, is there a flyer hanging from the door? Right. Are there three newspapers in the driveway? But Johnson is looking to do the opposite of squatters. He wants to protect homes from crooks. He and his wife started a new business, spouses watching houses. They watched as law enforcement struggled to keep squatters out from foreclosed homes to vacation and second homes. When they come up with these fake leases, well, now how do you determine whether it's real or not? Uh, a lot of times that has to go in front of a judge to make a, a decision. Johnson visits his clients' homes once a week, looking for signs of intruders and for anything else that needs attention. That means there's moisture getting in through one of these panes. This is probably not sealed very well. He runs the water, he checks the fridge, walks around the outside of the home, making sure squatters aren't around. The person would have less than four, five days, tops. From the time that I was last there. If you want to keep strangers out of your neighborhood, Johnson recommends keeping the house unappealing to squatters. If you see a house that's got an overgrown yard or the bushes haven't been taken care of, it's kind of a sign that mm, somebody's probably not there very often. Johnson also recommends putting lights on a timer and keeping newspapers and trash cans out of sight. And if you can't hire a company to keep watch of your house, at least have a friend or a neighbor keep a lookout for signs of squatters. Like your own private security, just a person to come around, check on things for you. Uh, but what are police doing about the squatter situation if it's that big of a problem? It is a big problem and they are looking into it, but that's why it's so important that you keep a lookout for your house because they don't know until you find out and someone calls them and then police find them. And if they do find them in your house, they are prosecuting. Yeah. All right, Shannon, thank you for that. And if you or someone you know is dealing with squatters or has a home that they won't be in for a while, make sure you go to WFLA.com. We have put together a list of tips on how to protect your home from squatters.